Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're gonna take a look at the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 and Phantom Green, and I'm gonna show you some must-have accessories. Now all of this stuff you could get from Amazon, I'll throw the links up in the description. The prices range from 20 to 1800 bucks. All right, so let's get right into it. First things first, shout out to White Shoes. She got the day off. Now look, I'm not gonna spend too much time talking about the Z Fold 3. We already unboxed it. We already did a full review. I showed y'all a bunch of cases, but today I'm gonna show you a few more cases and I got one accessory that you really need to see, the wireless car mount, all right? That's the dopest one that I found yet. Now I've been buying a lot of accessories. These are the ones that I like the best. Okay, so here's my retail version of the Galaxy Z Fold 3 5 Gangster. All right, got it in phantom green. Of course, got the Incredible Hulk. Here we go. One more. Now, this is definitely going to be my daily driver, especially after you see this car mount. Okay, so here we go. Let's see how the Phantom Green version looks. Now, you know, no charge in the box. Typical bullshit. Here it is. Okay. Now, this is my first time seeing this one in person. I know some of y'all never seen it yet either. Here's a quick comparison to the black. Okay, now you can really see the difference a little bit. But this is that green. Let me do the smell test on this real quick. Mm! Oh, this smells like the chronic right here. All right. This is the new Incredible Hulk 5 Gangster. Okay. Z Fold 3 and Phantom Green. All right. So let's take it over to the accessories. Next up. Now I'm going to try to say this without laughing. We got the Samsung 25 watt super fast wall charger. I know. Super fast 25 watts. Now this one is going to run you 20 bucks. Now, if you bought the Galaxy Z Fold 3, you know it doesn't come with a charger. And if you don't have any chargers laying around, you're going to need one. All right, so let's check this one out. Quick $20 charger. Rah. Here we go. Now, comes in black, and I think it comes in white also. Okay. Now, <laughs> no cable. All right, but your phone does come with a cable, so you're not going to need that. This is a 25-watt super-fast charging brick. Now look, on a side note, if you don't have a charger at all, my recommendation would be save up a couple of more dollars and get this one. Now this is my favorite wall charger. This is the Besus 100 watt fast charger. I had 100 watts, this is fast charging. Now look, it's not gonna charge your Galaxy any faster, but my theory is you'd rather have more power than less power because at some point, Samsung, Apple, some of these other companies are gonna start coming out with faster charging phones like Xiaomi. Now, say you got this Fold and you bought this 25 watt charger and then you say, you know what? I don't like the Fold anymore. I wanna go with the Mi 11 Ultra, one of the big boys. That phone has 67 watt fast charging. So this charger is not gonna help you. Buy one like this, okay? It's gonna charge your Galaxy the same speed, but at some point you're gonna buy a tablet, you're gonna buy a laptop, you're gonna buy something that has faster charging speed capability you rather have more power than less power. All right, so this one is 50 bucks. This is the one that I recommend. But if you don't care about all that and you just want a quick charger, go with this one, all right, 20 bucks. And on a side note, y'all remember this one? Woo! The Tom Brown, same thing, 25 watt, super fast. <laughs> all right, super fast charger brick, I know. Let's keep it moving. Next up, we got the Samsung Galaxy Smart Tag. Now this one is gonna run you 30 bucks. Now this is one of those products that if you got a Galaxy phone, I would say is mandatory. All right, you need one of these. For 30 bucks, you can track your phone, track your car keys, track your luggage, track your kids, track your pet. If you're a scumbag, track your significant other. And you can also use reverse tracking from the smart tag to your phone. All right, so you can use the smart tag to track anything you want, and then you can reverse it and have the smart tag track your phone. I'm gonna show you exactly how that works. All right, 30 bucks on this one. Let me show you what it looks like. Okay, now it comes in a couple of different colors. Here it is. Now it actually has a button that has multifunctionality. Now, let me show you how this works. I'm gonna open up the SmartThings app on my phone. You see it says connect it. Now, say I can't find my car keys. Let's hit view on map. Okay, now I'm gonna block out my address real quick. Okay, and there it is. My address is right there and my location on the map. Now say I can't find the keys. 
Let's hit the button now. If I want to, I can search, navigate, have GPS take me directly to the keys or my luggage or my car, whatever I have the smart tag on, and I can have it ring. Let's hit ring. Okay, I'm gonna hit start. And there it is. Here's my smart tag on my car keys. So if they was lost, that's the sound that I would hear. How dope is that? Now watch this. Now say I want to reverse track. I can't find my phone. I'm going to go to my smart tag. Let's hit the button twice. And there it is. Look at that. Now, um, <laughs> shout out to all y'all old school cats. Y'all know that ringtone. I'll do it one more time. Now, look, I'm going to put my phone in my pocket. So say I'm just drunk somewhere and I don't remember that my phone is in my pocket. Where's my phone at? Where's my phone before I start panicking? There it is. Now, y'all know that sound. Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, select, start. 30 men. All right, shout out to the old school cat. Y'all know about the 30 men. This is dope, all right? Samsung Smart Tag, and I'll tell y'all a quick story. When I took a Maya to college the other day, I always travel with one of these, and I travel with an air tag in my bag just for our redundancy. So when we landed in Florida, I would hashtag big words alert. When we landed in Florida, our bags was like the last one to come through the carousel. So we like, oh man, we hope we didn't uh, put our bags on the wrong flight. So I said, you know what, before I start panicking, let me pull out my phone and track my bag. And sure enough, when I pulled out the phone, it said my bag was in Tampa, Florida. Didn't have the exact location, but it's in Tampa, Florida, around the airport. So I knew that it was coming soon. All right, so Samsung Smart Tags, this is mandatory, all right? And it's so much better than the Apple AirTag because the AirTag, you can track from your phone to the AirTag, but you can't use the AirTag to track your phone. All right, if you lose your phone and you got an AirTag in your pocket, you asked out. But if you got the Smart Tag in your pocket, Hit that button twice. Not to mention, on a side note, when you go to settings and smart things, you can also have it where you press and hold the button, turn on your lights in the house. Double click, turn on your TV. This is sick. All right, let me do that one more time. Bang. Looking for my phone. Press it again, found it. All right, Samsung Smart Tag for 30 bucks by 40s. Next up. We got the Samsung Wireless Charger Trio. Now this one is gonna run you 65 bucks. Now you're getting three in one wireless charging, convenient and easy placement, compatible with the Galaxy Watch. Now this is nine watt fast wireless charging. I know, here we go again. And you got LED dimming mode. All right, 65 bucks. Now on a side note, if you don't have a Galaxy Watch, don't buy this one, buy the Wireless Charger Duo because you're gonna need it for two phones. You're gonna waste the slot if you don't have the watch. Hashtag bars. All right, let's check this one out. Got the zombie killer this time. Here we go. Rah. One more. Rah. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why that makes me laugh all of the time. All right, here we go. Wireless charger trio. Now inside. Okay, now this is kind of cool. You get a plug. All right, you got the plug. You get a charging cable. Okay, now this is going to be USB type C to USB type C. And this is your wireless charging pad. Now on the bottom, you got two rubber stoppers. That's gonna keep it in place. There's your USB Type-C charging slot. Just gonna plug that in. And you plug it into a wall charger. Okay. And here it is. Now in the front, you got a spot for your Galaxy Watch. Let's see if this is plugged in. Let's see, I don't see any. Okay, there it is. Plugged in right there. Let's drop a Galaxy Watch on there. Okay, that's charging up. Let's drop some uh, phones on real quick. Okay, let's find a sweet spot on this. Let's see, is it high or low? Once you find the sweet spot, then you'll know where it's at forever. Okay. There it is, okay. That's one. And let's find the second one. Let's see, okay, there it is. Okay, charge three devices at the same time. Now, like I said, if you don't have a Galaxy Watch, don't waste your money, buy the wireless charger Duo. That one is $20 cheaper, it's gonna be two phones. This is two phones and a watch. 
Now you can also charge your iPhone or any other wireless charging phone, but it's only gonna work on the Galaxy Watch. It's not gonna work on your Apple Watch. All right, this is perfect for traveling. All right, so anyway, this is the wireless charger trio, 65 bucks. Next up, we got the Samsung flip cover with S Pen. Now this one is gonna run you 80 bucks. Now you get an antimicrobial cover protection from degradation. All right, now that's a lot of big words right there. Here we go. Now this one is gonna come with the cover and your S Pen. Now this is not the S Pen Pro. All right, let me work on my flick of the wrist real quick. Let's see, anything else before I go too crazy? You got your usual books and shit, flick of the wrist. Now you got some different S Pen tips and your removal tool, uh, <laughs> removal tool. okay? See so a bunch of different tips. If you draw a lot, just take the tip out just like that, giggity. And here we go. All right, so let's see. Let's drop this on the phone real quick. <laughs> a little drop test. Okay. Now this one slaps right on. And there's your cover. S Pen drops right in the back. Okay, 80 bucks on this one. Let's check wireless charge. And on the side note, this is one of my favorite wireless chargers, the Razer Chroma. Now the reason that I like this one so much is because y'all know I'm all about hashtag RGB life, but this one has a static color, and then when you put something that has wireless charge on it, if the wireless charge works, it starts flashing. So this way you always know when your device is being charged. Okay, so here we go. So there's your wireless charge. Let's see, there's your cutouts. Now there's no magnet on this, so you get a lot of flappage, but you do get some screen protection when the phone is in your pocket. And the biggest part is you got storage for your S Pen. All right, so let's open this up. Matter of fact, let's see how this looks opened up. Okay. And let's see how this S Pen, let's we get the S Pen action. There it is. Let's see who we calling today. Let's call Dave instead. Call Dave. All right, that's my little reminder. When you close the phone, drop the S Pen right in there. Now, my biggest gripe with this case is, other than the price, I would have liked to have seen a little locking mechanism. I hate the flappage. And I'm not a big fan of flappage. I don't like it when my case is sturdy. But the best thing about this case is now you can walk around with your S Pen instead of walking around like this. Now, I, this is how I've been rocking the last couple of days. This is annoying. All right, because when you get up, oh, where's my S Pen? Where's my S Pen? This starts to get annoying. Okay, so this case is a little bit pricey, 80 bucks, but your S Pen is right on hand. So as soon as you open up your device, bong, take it right over to your S Pen. Start going crazy. Okay, so this is the flip cover with S Pen. 80 bucks on this one. Let's see, all the cutouts line up. Everything looks official. Y'all already seen wireless charge. I'll do it one more time just in case. All right, there it is. And let's check one thing. Let's check for flap it from the S Pen. All right, now this S Pen is not coming out. All right, you really got to take it out. So I like that. I don't like that. All right, S View, uh, S flip cover with S Pen. Let's keep it moving. Next up, we got a case from Spec. Now this is the Presidio Perfect Clear. This one is gonna run you 45 bucks. Now on a side note, I do got a few more cases, but I'm gonna save that for a different video. I'm just waiting for these uh, UAG cases, and then I'm gonna do the rest that I got. Okay, UAG, VRS, and whatever else comes in. But right now, I just wanna show y'all this one. Let's see, okay, now they put a little sticker on this. Okay, I almost broke it. <laughs> Anger level's increasing. Ah, okay, here it goes. All right, there it is. Okay, what is that? Ah, okay, slap the back on, slap the front on. Now this one has a gel skin kind of feel to it. Okay, let me get a little wipe down on this. Transparent style case. When you open it up, let's see. Okay, this is nice. You get a nice amount of razivity on the front. Okay, there's your cutouts, cutouts, cutouts. Everything lines up. It gives it a nice sticky feel. All right, so if you got butterfingeritis and you're always dropping your phone, you might want a case that has a little bit more stickiness to it. Let's check wireless charge. There it is. All right, this is cool. Presidio, perfect clear, 45 bucks. Now on the inside, you do have a nice amount of razivity also. Let's see the lock screen for today. I've right, got the fireworks. Okay, on the outside, <laughs> we got Empire State Building. Okay, and one more case real quick. If you like that one, and you got a Z Flip 3, it also comes for the Z Flip. 
Let's get and check this one out. Okay, now let's see. Okay, maybe you don't even, oh, maybe I broke it. <laughs> maybe you didn't have to separate it. Let's try that. Let's see. Okay. Okay, yeah, you don't have to separate it. Let's see, did I break it? I might have broke it. But either way, it still stays on. <laughs> stays on, though. But anyway, all right, so if you got a Z Flip 3, this one definitely gives you that sticky feeling, all right? I love that. Nice amount of razivity. And it is clear so you can showcase the color of your phone. The only thing is it kind of looks like a fingerprint magnet. Maybe you got to wipe, on, uh, wipe down the inside before you put it on. But I like that grip. All right, nice grippy feel. The case doesn't move around at all. No hinge protection, but it's dope. Let's check the wireless charge on this one. There it is. Okay, Presidio, perfect clear, 45 bucks on these. All right, now, just in case this is your first Z Fold 3 video, let me just do a quick recap. If you need the most protection, all right, go with the Spigen Slim Armor Pro. All right, this one is going to give you the most protection. Now, one of my favorite ones is the leather case. Okay, now let's see how this leather looks on the green. Okay, here's your green. Okay, now that green and brown leather do look sick. Okay, slaps on just like that. There it is. This is the leather case. Okay, now this is gonna be my going out style case. The case that I use all day, every day is the Armored Fiber. All right, this is my favorite case. Last year, it was the leather case as my favorite. This year, it's the Armored Fiber. Let me go ahead and slap this one on real quick. This one doesn't add any extra thickness. And y'all know I'm all about that race car life. Here, here it is. And of course, ladies and gentlemen, late but still great, White Shoes is back in the building. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. White shoes. I love my white shoes. Calm down. Here's the armored fiber. All right, now this is my favorite case. Like I said, no extra thickness. And it just looks sick. No fingerprints on this one. I love it. All right, so these are my favorite cases so far. Like I said, maybe in the next couple of days, I'm going to do UAG and VRS. Now, if the UAG cases don't come in the next two days, then I'm just going to go ahead and do the VRS cases. Now, I got one more product I want to show you. This is my favorite accessory so far. All right. Now, quick side note. Usually, I always walk around with a Galaxy Z Fold uh, in my pocket, but I never really rock it in the car because I haven't found a good wireless car charging mount until now. All right, check out this wireless car charging mount. All right, so last up, we got the Deer Hot 15 watt fast wireless car charger. Now this one is gonna run you 50 bucks. Now I've been using this one all day long. I fell in love with it. This is the first car wireless charger that I had that actually works. Now inside, you're gonna get your wireless charger. I just took it out of my car, but it also comes with a suction mount because this is gonna go into your AC vents. Now, depending on which kind of car you have, it might not fit correctly in the vents. So if it doesn't, you can mount this to your windshield, mount it on the top of your dashboard, and then you can put this part right here. But if it does happen to fit in your vents, use the vent clip. All right, it's gonna look so much better. I got some videos showing y'all how it works. It also comes with usual books and shit, pluck them and file them, and you get USB-A to USB Type-C charging cable, okay? Now, here's how it works. You're going to put this end into your vent, and then on the top, you're going to snap it down. That's going to lock it into place. Now, it'll look better when I show you in the car, but right now, just for demonstration purposes, say my finger was your car vent, your AC vent, just stick it right in the vent, put it on the top, plug in your cable into your cigarette lighter. All right, so you're going to put USB Type-C. Let me grab a USB Type-C cable right into the bottom. All right, you're gonna get a little light. That blue light turns on, now it's working. Look at that. Now, when you put your Galaxy Fold in, it automatically closes and it's gonna start charging. Now, when you wanna take your phone out, you see that button on the bottom? You just tap that button, grab your phone, and take it right out, okay? Now watch this. You see it's charging up, hit the button, take it right out. Now, you can also, this is why I said I'm going to be rocking this in my car now, because you can put it in your car, 
fully opened. All right, so let's simulate the vent again. You're going to come in your car, drop it on just like that, and there it is. Now, one thing that you got to be mindful of, if you want wireless charge, it has to be on the camera side. Okay, now, one thing that's dope, huh? one thing that's dope about the Galaxy Fold is it works in any orientation. All right, whichever way you flip it, upside down or not, it's going to work. All right, so if you put it in upside down and it's not charging, then you know that you put it in the wrong way. All right, giggity. <laughs> All right, here's what you do. All right, so when you get in your car, make sure you got the camera side down, drop it on, you get wireless charge, and there it is. When you get out, hit the button, and you're good to go. Now, my biggest concern when I bought this was, is it gonna stay in place when I'm driving around? Because I had one of these last year for the Galaxy Z Fold 2. As soon as I put the fold on it, and I started driving around, I hit a pothole, it popped out. This one right here is ultra durable, and if you don't believe me, take a look at this test right here. All right, so here's how it looks set up in the car. Got it right in the AC vent, plugged into a power source. So let's grab a Galaxy Z Fold. Charging right up. Now when you want to take it out, press the button on the bottom. There it is. Now let's open this up. All right, and there it is. Now, as far as the durability, I'm gonna drive around a little bit and see if it shakes. But so far, this looks dope. Here's how your Google Maps gonna look. Bang. All right, so when you're driving around, that's how it's gonna look. When you're ready to get out the car, press the button, and you're out of there. Now, in order for it to charge, it has to be on the camera side. Then it'll start charging right up. Let's open it back up. See if I can flip this with one hand, bonk. Okay. Now, if you put it upside down, it's not gonna charge. You gotta make sure you put the camera side on the bottom. There it is. So far, it's holding up all the bumps. All right, shout out to this dude. I like him. <laughs> all right, so far, it's holding up to all of the bumps, though. I right, hear some real bumps right here, though. All right, here we go. This is real bumps. Here we go. Okay, now, if it's not moving on these bumps right here, you're going to be good. I'm going to hit this bump on purpose. Look at that. This is another one right here. This is a go right here. Hey, right, this is sick. All right, so these are all of the accessories that I got so far. Hit me up in the comments and let me know if there's anything else y'all wanna see. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google Plus. Shout out to all the Google Gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Boxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time. 100% full throttle. And a special shout out 
to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know, stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Oh yeah, special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat. Flossy underscore Carter, that's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad. I see y'all in the comment section early. Hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and pitch and be rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. Spot to the beam up, me and shoes. Alright, shoes. You ready? Let's get up out of here. Energize. I want everybody to subscribe to Flossy Carter for the real tech reviews. Now, Flossy Carter, we know you Flossy. Now, guess what? I'm flashy. Money may all day, the one and only. Flossy Carter, you part of the money team.